We are broadcasting live from the Thunderdome in Cinerapolis, Forsky, Minnesota. And the mutant eaters have a proud history in the MFL of winning just about everything but the really big game that matters. And maybe that's why they have the same exact number of bars and churches. Hey, shut up and pass the data dots, huh? And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Carcass City Creeps take on the Purple Mutant Eaters. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Hi again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with the only guy to ever get cut from the league for testing positive for not taking enough steroids or mutant growth hormones, Brickhead Mulligan. Hey, there was a reason for that. I had to quit taking steroids. My nut sack was shrinking, and I sprouted this mini me on my shoulder. Bricks Jr., freak me out. You're a pussy. He's at the 20. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. <laughs> <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot one. Hot. And he just slipped away like a greased pig. When it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd have been fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. First down. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. <laughs> and that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, huh? Third down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Defense goes one speed. Man, that defender just turned it. It's a touchdown. He could probably be a better dancer if he went to dance class, but as you can see, he uh, doesn't have the stomach for it. Yeah, you 
Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. for a first down. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Roy Drill now it's a sticky ball dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo of doom. Did you ever think you'd say that, Grim? A yo-yo of doom? No, my friend. I didn't. I love this job. Third down and, well, good luck. First down and don't die. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And it's first and ten. Defense was reading him like a man. What a hit that was. Huh. I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Grim. <laughs> First and goal. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. First and eight to go. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Looks like he does have some turkey skin wrapping on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. Okay, nice and easy like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. Hunt one, hunt two, hunt, hunt, hunt. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. Hunt one, hunt. And that's another, oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. Now the defense 
called a time warp dirty trick, negating that play completely. The offense is pissed. Well, I wish I had that trick in the arm that it would be earlier. I let one rip. I made a really good one, Grim. And then the doors open and the team's cheerleaders get on. <laughs> That's what small talk is really put to the test. <laughs> He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. First and ten. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down and nine. Hot one. Hot. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that? Oh, uh, come on. That was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. First down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot eight. And the defense holds that pass play to only two yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. Hey, what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? And that'll bring him third down and seven. And the court. Oh, with the brutal hit. And coach isn't liking that call. Oh, his head just exploded. <laughs> First down and one. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First down and one. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Yeah, I've had it. I'm running out. Oh, with the brain scrambler. The teams are all tied up at the end of quarter one. We'll be right back. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. 
origin. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. <laughs> Third down and ten. He had it for a second there. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. They just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. You can't keep a good mutant down. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. First and ten. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. But that means he can wrap up the other half. It's it. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, Bricks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. Sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. Second down and two. And it's two yard run before he stopped. Third down and a sliver. Oh, 
Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? Second down and five. <laughs> And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And it's first and ten. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. Second down and ten. At this point with multiple interceptions. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And that player just transformed it like a monkey trying to... He could go all the way. The 20. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. First and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. It shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Oh, the player's favorite. And it's first and ten. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Second down and ten. Well, that'll trim your nostril hairs once and for all. Third down and three. That's the way 
to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Ah, oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completion. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Oh, so close, but not today. Yeah, man, I was hanging on the kettle now. You know what happened? And it's first and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My Father was a very smart man, Rex. Very smart. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. Yo, man, nobody can touch my ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Well, little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. It's first and ten. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just cock blocked the clock. Second down and two. Inflated the quarterback's balls right there. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> and they take their last time out. It's between them and the clock now, Grim. Well, and the defense, too. Third and four.
And it's first and ten. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. That's a little on the nose. And that is caught for a first down. First and ten. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a, uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. I'm a high-scaled seller. I am a hell of a seller. First and two. Well, Fee finally, he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That the offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And that'll bring up second and one. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Seriously, man, if you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me, I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stop burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. The kicker died on that play. Man, that's terrible. Now what do they do? Well, another player will assume the kicking role for the remainder of the game. The coach is praying he won't need a long field goal to win this one. First and ten. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know. Good night, Irene. You ever get hit in the face with a shovel, Graham? I have. And trust me, the hit that guy just took was worse. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Third down and five. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. First and four. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And that puts six points on the board! The defense can do anything to stop a throw to have good, man! You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? He was gonna kill him now. He only had... Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. <laughs> Kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. Ooh. 
And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? How have they not killed him yet? He's wearing a new mink coat, for God's sake. He's seven layers of smarmy, Grim. And it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. First and ten. And that pass play is good for eight yards. Second down and two. Does the QB? No, oh, the old broke back mountain play. Got hit by a mountain of Newton. Got his back broken and now he's in a mountain of pain. And it's first and ten. like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. Second down and six. <laughs> Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. up 10 yards on that play. I know I've said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. Second down the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. The offense is down to their last running back. If they lose him, they lose all their running plays. And it's first and ten. Picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the people. He's sick when he should have zagged and ends up a shish kebab. He, he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? today and deliver their home team fans a forfeit. Ah, Grim, some of the defensive mutant leader players are snacking on the left of the body parts. Why do you think they're called the purple mutant leader, you idiot? They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I know wounds taste just like chicken. I was it? Scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. Mm -hmm. Good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. <laughs> with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League.
Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.